ancient writing from the Old Kingdom.
writing from the old kingdom.
Idiot.
You accompany me. Sekhmet favors the generous. Medjai, help me. I will pay you. What do you need? Morias para que vas mata tu da esti. Nun es kede. Idiotin, oran bulimiti mi kanesteri raik senet. Gods here are vigilant.
Spot any danger. Watch my back. Whoever thinks they can mess with us is in for a surprise. I'm going to die to shit. You hear me? Keep an eye Be out right for there. Me. Hold fast. Hey, what? Hey, hey. Die? die, worm. <laughs> Give me a hand over here. You! Yeah, big guy! You have got the look of a man who can have things! Uh, namely, me and my injured foot! I come on the priest's request, drummer. Then get me out of here, Fletcher! I cannot help but think. You seem cheerful for a man unable to walk. You jest, Charlie. This is the best day of my life! My foot will cost that Tana! Surely your health is worth more than that. If I can prove nothing, you would be correct. That is where you come in, friend.
What is it you think I can do? Find the fools who stole it, of course. Return that skin and clear my name. Who stole the lion skin? I turned away from the lion skin for a moment, and a bandit nabbed it and ran away. I lost him in the crowd. It happened in the Egyptian district. The guards, of course, blamed me. Tough life being an Egyptian in Alexandria. I will find them then. Go on, get that skin. I will be fine. Just need to rest my leg. <laughs> then I will go and meet the priest. You clear my name. Bully me, Dimi. I'm a spinning like Sally. Tana lied about that skin. It's almost worthless. You know the Greeks. Easy enough work stealing from him. Skins for days. This is the skin? Oh, this poor beast. Blue is no color for a lion.
somos afrocines. This man is a thief! He is Theon. He claims to not have stolen a thing. Do you wish Serapis displeased with you? No. I am going to sue you for my broken leg, you naked idiot! That is not helping. I knew you Egyptians were all alike. This is what I get for hiring you. Thieves all! I have my best man on this. We will fix it. I am the wronged party here. My skin was stolen. And if you want it back, you will pay him for his suffering. And make amends by kneeling to Serapis. This is your answer, priest? Extortion? Fine. I feel Serapis and I have a long road ahead of us. Blessings on your journey, brother. I wish to serve Serapis further, if you have need. There is one thing. There has been food taken by the guards malignly in the name of Serapis. They take a tithe, then take double for themselves. They bring it to their arsenal and share it with their Philakitae. The people now starve. I worry it will get worse. Do not worry, priest. I will see the people fed. I will await among the people at the docks. Morias para que vas mata tu ta estima. From Seraphim. You guys are supposed to uphold the law. Pathetic. This food will be put to much better use.
واحد بدي ادخل شوف اه هير هارو اه خسينا بدخلنا جوتا One cart of food, priest, as asked for. The Pharaoh's guards were happy to donate it. This seni is more than I expected. The people will be served by Serapis today. May you walk lightly in his steps, priest. And you, Magi. Tell you less of this. If I see her again. Morias para as que vas mata tu dan estima. Love me, Nugi, Gnostis. Is this a terrible ceremony? There is so much blood, 
as if some butchery occurred here. But the elements have eroded many of the signs. Scraps of a message. Ah, there's too much missing. Troubling. If I had more information, I might understand this better. But as he was eaten by a crocodile, I'll keep my eye out for anything else so unusual. Clear the way. Oh. Oi, this mission of Afrosini. This must be dealt with quickly. Is there no you that insignia? You are a man of honor. There are so few remaining. I am a Magi. I solve problems. Good! I have one! A most precious treasure which must be delivered today. You will be well compensated for your work. Here are some drachmas to start. This city is much more expensive than I'm used to. Good! It is settled. Follow me. The thing I ask you to do is of the utmost importance. Of course it is. Being a merchant is no simple matter, sir. I assure you, moving tiger skins or even statues is not easy work. Ah, these workers never when you tell them to be. As I was saying... You must be quick. Oh, and do not stray from your task. At all. I will know if you have. This is all I have left since the flood. Seems you care a lot for your... cargo. 
I swear on her mother's grave she was sent from the gods to make Alexandria better. She? I have your bodyguard, Kara. Do not let this be a repeat of the last time, Doctor. Wait, so this hardly seems to be what you asked. Magi, I will pour drachmas down your throat as long as she is safe. Kara, remember the reception tonight. You will be ready. Of course, Father. I would not miss it. I am so happy you have come to assist me, sir. We will get you home fast. Do not worry. Oh, of course. Thank you, my bull. You look just like Heracles. Perhaps I'll call you my Heracles. Finally. Change of plans, Heracles. Who? Ah, no matter. Child, it's time to return you home. I will not go. Have you met the priests here? Dull. Now, I must go to the central market. I heard of new Persian women. I need them. Or what? I will scream, which will call the soldiers. Then, well, even if you survive, father will be quite angry. Anubis, take this city. Are you Sekhmet in disguise, sent to test me? What was that? Nothing. Good. First, we must get my horse. She's been treated absolutely terribly without me around. You'd think someone would clean this water. Ugh. You guide the boats well. Much better than any of my other bodyguards. No, if you want to go fast, it would be all right. Look at the city, Medjai. It must be so intimidating for someone like you. No, Miss Neo Gideon. part of the city. So rustic. Let us move! I cannot be late! You can smell it in the air. They live a truly simple life here. Pegasus simply can't wait to be reunited with me. Of course, you named your horse Pegasus. Cheer up! <laughs> Young Miss, it's so nice to see you again. As you asked, she has been given new shoes. There now, was that so difficult? Now out of my pay. The deal was only to get you home, not to pay for your horse. I'm sure my father would not be pleased with you discussing this in front of him, horseman. Of course. Uh, I'll discuss it with your father. Oh, Pegasus. I know you missed me. Yes, you did, you beautiful creature. If only you had wings. Time to go, bodyguard. Decision, get it. That is it. I am taking you home, Princess Kara. Oh, all you big broody types are the same. Never let me have any fun. I should just leave you here. You're duty bound to deliver me, are you not? Who would know if I left? Your conscience would, of course. Look there, bodyguard! Th that is where I had my first discussion with a soldier. I am sure he was very grateful. We must stop at the market for more linens. I will take you to your house as your father bade, and nowhere else. Now lead on. You know, you are absolutely destroying my chances at getting the perfect linens. There are different kinds of linen? are much more serious than my usual bodyguards. You could move faster, bodyguard. I have a name! Bayek. Ah, you do know my name. I remember all their names, you know. Whose names? The bodyguards. I send gifts to their families when I can. Gara. Gara. Yes? If we go find your linen. Would you be happy? Really? Of course! Thank you, Bayek! You 
have an interesting stare. Thank you. Amaxa e lovelies ga gakisteo. Amenito. Sight here. Show some promise. Oh, it's so heavy. Would you help me? Nayak! Pegasus! They stole my horse! Stay here. Do not leave. <laughs> it is done. Oh, there, girl. Hey, time to get you home. Your troublesome mistress will have missed you. Pegasus, huh? I like it. It suits a horse. I would like your spirit. Over here, but. Pegasus was limping, Bayek went to deal with her shoe. It was only gone a moment. Ah. I heard some commotion, but according to my little princess, you're the hero of the day. Can he always be my bodyguard? Please, father? How much does it cost to hire a Medjai permanently? I am here only a short while. Alas. Then allow me to grant you a hero's pay for a hero's service. Amaxa e lavnis ga gagisteos, amelison. Behind me, Gideon. Oh. Cannot escape. 
Morias para Meisonos Afrosinis. My dearest. The snake and Gennadios are dead. It was Eudorus. He died flailing in the baths. I wish I had been there. Wondering if I should pull you out. Your adrenaline and BP are elevated, and it's affecting your heart rate and hormonal markings. Serotonin and oxytocin in particular. What happened in there? Aya's here. Who's Aya? My ex-wife. I could feel her nearby. You can feel her? Pretty sure that's the bleeding effect. Along with Bayek's memories, you're you're also experiencing his emotions. No, you dork. I think she's actually in this cave. Spouses usually share the same tomb. A second mummy? We should really report to Abstergo. Maybe after I find Aya. I I'm gonna call it in if you don't. Deanna, no! If you do it there, well, get no credit. They'll cut me out like always. <sighs> okay. There. What is it? The bleeding effect is leading me to Aya. Oh, great. More fuel for your superhero complex. She's down there. My turn for a leap of faith. Leap of what? You're... <gasps> Damn, that's cool. I was right, she's here. Oh, there you are, thank God. I can almost taste the blood. Uh, uh, okay, you're making less and less sense, Leela. We need to report. Not yet. Not yet? So when? <sighs> well, I can't chew my way out of here. What are you doing now? Climbing. <clears throat> and it's hard, so... Uskuti, will you? Fine. Let me know when you get to the top.
I'm going back in. Why? I took a DNA sample from Aya. I want to see your memories. Look, I get that you're excited, but the more risks we take, the worse things could go for us. It's my dream on the line here. Let me do this my way. Damn it, my papers went everywhere. Whoops, anything important? Yeah, the notes on the Animus. Here's the blueprint from Adalysis system mod. Could have used a bigger fluid chamber. Could have used a bigger piece of tape over your mouth. Whoa, so aggro. ISDNA needs to go in the Animus. Adding ISDNA to the chamber. It'll take time to sequence. You won't be able to sync with her memories right away. Layla, something else you should know. Since you're mixing gene sequences in an uncontrolled manner, the transition between memories will likely be unpredictable. I'm comfortable with unpredictability. Yeah? Well, I'm worried. You always are. What is it? The snake. What if he was not the last? Of course he was the last. They are all dead. Justice is done. <sighs> if there is any question, Apollodorus will know. He knows all. And where will I find this man who knows so much? He is with Cleopatra. But find his man first near the Hippodrome. Hey! I'll tell Thanos that Gennadios is dead and meet you later. Enjoy the Hippodrome. Don't lose all your money at the races. <clears throat>
I am Bayek. Aya sent me to speak to Apollodorus. Shh! I'm sure you can appreciate that my master takes precautions concerning those he meets. I have a question only he can answer. I will tell him you seek his counsel, and that Aya recommends you. Wait for tonight. If he sees fit to meet you, you will be found near the lighthouse then. Until then, the Hippodrome's commemorating one of its greatest racers. 
plenty of drinking and festivities, along with the races themselves, of course, if that appeals. His name was Icarus, the glory of the raucous hippodrome, the match loaded and showed land. Senifa, is it you? Bayak, you sour-facey one. <laughs> I, I am Claridas now. What are you doing here? Icarus was a thousand times better than you. <laughs> Who's going to lead you greens now, Malakia? You're a babe at the teeth. You think you can win the Cursus Magnus? <laughs> Horseshit! Leave Nikias alone. Icarus' death was a dark day for all of us. Let him weep in peace. So... Is Aya with you? Ah, uh, hey, I'm alone. <laughs> I was just asking. Hey, ask my foot next time. <laughs> no matter. Join us at the tavern later. Hmm? <laughs> Jai, great warrior, come. I sell you what you want. You need it, I have it. If I don't have it, you don't need it. Redda has your back in these desolate lands. You are but a boy. How did you come by such fine treasure? Plucked from the ancient lands of the desert, the sunken vessels of the Nile, refined by handmaidens of the gods, weaponry forged in Nubian mines, Persian jewels, and Assyrian treasures. I have it all. I see. You are well-traveled for such a young man. Old wisdom, Neb. I have acquired from long nights in the desert with my camel. I will see what you have. Come, look around. If you want good, Neb, I have other jobs too. Carlos 
consejo. A friend of mine went missing. Mejai, I would not ask, but he would be missed by his family. Please find where he's gone. Last month when five chariots off. So I said, it's not your pig I'm talking about, it's your wife! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Bayak! How long has it been? A decade? <laughs> More? <laughs> you left Siwa a long time ago, huh? And you left your name behind too. I had to. Claridas is a name better suited for the Hippodrome. <laughs> Remember the horses we rode outside Siwa? Huh? Oh, those nags. <laughs> I thought you would never leave that shithole. Mm. Siwa. Small, poor, and ugly. <laughs> the only beauty there was Aya. Has it changed much? Has she? Things change. People change. <laughs> ah, I need another drink. <laughs> Pardon, Neb. I overheard Clarida say you once rode together. My father sponsors the Prazina Greens, and we are in need of a mighty racer. I'm only here to drink and forget. Leave him alone, Nikias. <laughs> Real men are drinking here tonight. <laughs> Bayek, come. Let me show you something inspiring, huh? Where are you taking me, Senefa? Please, Claridas. I have not been Senefa in years. Ah, why did you change your name? To succeed in the Hippodrome, one must be welcomed by the Greek houses. So, a Greek name. You abandoned your name, your home. Siwa was nothing to me. The Greeks may look down on us, but screw them. I eat and drink well on what I win. Clear the way. Clear the way. I have no ambition to race at the Hippodrome. You? <laughs> no, never. They cheer for me. Besides, you would need a sponsor, a real chariot. Now, 
Icarus. He was a true hero. Did you know he won a thousand races and survived twice as many? See how they loved Icarus? You have adopted their gods too. Aye. Boy, this maze on us have foreseen us. Our gods never did anything for me. You're lucky I left. If I had stayed, Aya would have been mine. You are drunk and an ass. You have no idea what I give up. Oh, the world is hard. You always looked down on me in Siwa. Thought you were better. I never. Doesn't matter. I have found fame. At what cost? You gave up your home, your name, your gods. You trust this path. And it has brought me all the coin and cunt I want. Now you always wanted glory. It is not what drives all of us. And all you wanted was Aya and little Bayax. What made you abandon your dream? Enough. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> You alive? Yeah. <laughs> you are old. Time for me to dunk my head. Uh, the beer hits harder than you. What in Dionysus' name were you talking to Nikias about last night? Nikias? Who? Don't bullshit me. I saw you. What? You think his father will just welcome you onto the Prasina Green team? You really think you can roll onto the track and win races with no training? No skill? Piss on you! Maybe I should seek this Nikias out and hear his offer. If you can win, Claridas, it can't be that hard. You might want to pray first. You'll need all the help you can get to survive the Hippodrome. The gods will watch us race and decide. You have your gods, I have mine. We'll see who rides out covered in glory. Enough has been said. <laughs> Let the gods judge you in the Hippodrome.
Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
This is the man Redder spoke of. Dead.
Whoa. Yeah. Did you ever see work as fine as Onirises? I wish I could afford one of his weapons. Did you ever see the Serpent of Serapis? A spear light as a feather, that is sharper quite the than story. Sobek's tooth. With such a spear, I could be a champion in the amphitheater. Shame about what happened to it. Ah, the Serpent of Serapis. You have heard the tragic tale? Not the whole of it. Oh, it was a true masterpiece. The shaft, wrapped with water-hardened leather. The blade, hammered out of the metal of heaven. I would love to see it. Impossible. I crafted it for one of Apollodorus' captains when I lived in Saïs. But Sefeto's soldiers killed him. That is the reason I left. Sefeto? Yes, Sefeto the Firebrand, who governs Saïs with flame and fear. One of his bootlickers stole the spear that bears my mark. Outrageous. Can you not get it back? The man is beyond my reach. He sails on one of Sefeto's triremes on Mariatus Lake. Ah, I hate a bully. My travels take me far and wide. If I come across him, I will look for your spear. I would love nothing more than to hear of his fall. If you manage it, the Serpent of Serapis is yours. The strong must clout. Oh, the gods shame me, Neb. The Tanner is my husband. He carries that stench home whenever he returns from camp. Is he here now? By the smell? You would think so. But it's worse when he's around. Do not let it trouble you. We all must do work we do not relish. You are right. My husband works hard, but cannot keep up with the demand for his services. The Medjai are said to be legendary hunters. If you would like to earn some good coin, go and see him. I'm sure he could use your help. Hmm. I will consider it. Where would I find him? His hunting camp is north and west of Sao. He will be standing hides for a few days. If only there was some way for him to deal with the snake. Right decision, Gerek. this? Ah, scented oils. Might take the edge off the Tanner stench.
Litopolis. They are going to risk the trip? So she said, their farm is failing, so they see it as a new start. It sounds like a lot of work. To restore and rebuild a whole city. You can have the weapon, yes, but they say it's the cost of a new life. If you believe them. Well, I'll wait for Nufure to get settled and write us with news. Then we will see. You there? Stop.
not to draw attention here. Another God's cursed rebel? Wait, did I? <laughs> Magnificent. Clearly, the work of that master from Sao Village. The serpent of Serapis is a weapon worthy of the gods. I must borrow this. Such it. There's no end go. I send it.
should not be seen in this area. Nebeth, what grief has swallowed you? We... we came to pay our respects to Icarus, to make an offering for him, to ride victoriously in the next life. But... but... Gently now. I'm listening. Blue ruffians came at us. They jeered at our sorrow. And when my Halius spat in their faces, they struck him down. They killed him, then stole a bust of Icarus and ran. Now, my younger son Icarus has gone off towards the shore, chasing after those blue demons. I fear he'll join his brother. We came to mourn our hero, and now my family is destroyed. Please, Medjai, save my last son. Don't let his life end today. Go back to your home. Try to rest. I will find him and bring him back to you. Oh. <laughs> 
Polodoros. You there! Are you here to kill me or to be my friend? Friend. Bike of Siwa. Ah, then your help, please. You are I as Mejai, huh? Any other survivors? Only Damastis. They took him prisoner. And the scroll, what of the scroll? Damastis had it. That ass Damastis should have destroyed it. Cleopatra owes you much. Can you get to a healer by yourself? I've killed you, Doros. Huh? Well done. He was the snake, yes? Man to man, Bayek, there is much you have yet to understand. <laughs> man to man, I need an answer. Uh, I must take the measure of you first. Rescue the masters and recover the scroll. And then I will know if you're the man that Aya claims you to be. Where is this Damastis? He should be on the docks in Carnopos Harbor. I can't risk that someone reads the scroll he carries. This is heavily guarded. Hey, what? He's climbing! Get him down! Hey! 
I was going to kill all of them. That damn cage was too hard to get out of is all. Apollodorus sent me to help you. Give me the scroll. Scroll? I do not have any scroll. Your job was to carry it. I hid it on our ship. I did not want it to fall into the wrong hands. Where is the ship? At the bottom of the lake. They sank it. Ah, very well. I will get it. Apollodorus is waiting for you at the lighthouse. I will tell him to find you near the sunken ship. Precious scroll. Neck. The god love a generous soul. Here's your precious papyrus. Well done, Bayek. I see you are a capable man. Someone I may be able to trust. 
scroll was meant for the Roman general Pompey in an effort to sway Rome to Cleopatra's side. She will be grateful to you for keeping the communication secret. She is at my estate. We're headed there now. How does Aya fit into all this? Her cousin Phanos informed me that she was a driven woman stalking deadly prey. It so happened that I also had reason to bring down this prey. When Aya was successful, I stepped in to protect her. We are grateful. And we are grateful that you have eliminated Eudorus. He was an odious individual. I should tell you that in addition to Eudorus, I put an end to the Philakatai of Alexandria, Gennadios. Gennadios? I am very glad he is dead. But it will cause serious problems for you. The Felakis are a tightly bound group. And murderers. They will certainly come after you. So be it. Can I ask why you wanted Eudorus dead? As you know, Cleopatra's brother, Ptolemy, is too young and pliable to be a strong leader. We believe Eudorus was the force behind Ptolemy, responsible for so many of Egypt's current ills. Here we are. The villa is up ahead. more at the villa. The queen enjoys the life of high society. I'm pleased that Aya is bringing some sober substance to Cleopatra's social circle. She is an extraordinary woman, your wife. I know. Bayek, before I can disclose all secrets, Cleopatra must meet and approve of you. She can be particular. Let me give you some advice. When you approach the queen, Bend your knee in deference. Speak only in reply. Yours is not to question, but to answer. Do not be distracted by the festivities. She has a large entourage, and they like to amuse themselves. Sometimes to excess. Speak clearly, in measured tones, and above all, do not meet her gaze. <laughs> 